Blood. You sang it all right. That do come back yes, man. It's a lot of practice. It's the only way to get good. I could be real good, man. I could be real, real good. Sure. I have to get some sleep. Hey, you mad this for me. And tell she has a right. What should I tell Louise? Tell she she got here from me just now. What? Tell she knew everything going good. Alright. What is it, Cindy? I want to spend the night with you. That is impossible. And you know it. Now go back to your room like a good girl. Don't you like me? Of course I like you, Cindy. But you are much too young. And furthermore, I'm married. That's nothing. From the day I saw you, I knew it had to be. For what? I want you to be the first. I'm very flattered, Cindy. But I think you have a lot of growing up to do for the kind of experience you are thinking of. Give yourself time. Don't be carried away by everything you read in books. One of these days, you'll meet a nice guy and fall in love, read love, and then you'll know when you're ready for a serious relationship. My advice to you is to concentrate on your books and you run it. Good night, sir. Good night, sir. stay here with your business and I'm sure you'll find someone nice to settle down with. If that's what you want. It's you I want. And what you want you get. Is that right? I love you. You know that. You're so sweet, Connie. That's why I didn't marry you then and why I can't marry you now. You're not making much sense, though. I have to be free, Connie. It's the way I am. Free to go where and when I like, for how long I like, with whom I like. And you would never tolerate that. We can never be happy together. Let's enjoy it together. But we can't have a future together. You know that. Next, on Turn of the Tide. Where is she? Where is she? The woman who was in here with you, where is she, Charlie? Nobody was in here, Betty. I was in bed with a fever. Look how I'm sweating. You think I'm stupid, Charlie? I said I'm sorry. Being sorry doesn't make everything all right. 
What do you want? For me to kneel down and beg for forgiveness? When a man comes home, he expects to find a place of peace, not a lot of nagging. Now, if you are nice to me, the way you were to Mr. White, I can forget all about what I saw. Now, what do you say? Mr. Oh, I think I'm bluffing. I'll go to the principal. I'll go to your father. <laughs>